we're going to uh, be going next, folks, to the emptiness that is uh, the Walt Disney World Resort and Lorena. This is a prediction that I made uh, about a month ago. Told folks that May was going to be a very, very bad month for the Walt Disney Resort. Turns out that Memorial Day yesterday was not good, no bueno, for the House of Mouse. And I'm trying to figure out just exactly how low they can go before we get some kind of change. But before we uh, hop into that story, take a look here. This is uh, something that you provided to us, Lorena, via X slash Twitter. You said 15 minute wait for Big Thunder Mountain Railroad. It's been like that since around 3 p.m. And you posted this yesterday, which was, folks, Memorial Day, Memorial Day weekend. Now, Jonas, if you would, please... Bring up your story, because this is fascinating to us. Bring up your story, please, Jonas. Well, uh, let, let's first st start with uh, the spin that we were getting before we get into what actually happened. If we go over here to uh, WDWmagic.com, I'm not saying that WDW Magic was engaging in spin. I'm saying this is the report coming out of MCO. MCO, for those of you who aren't aware, is the airport closest to Walt Disney World Resort. It's well, it's the Orlando Airport. MCO predicts record-breaking travel for Memorial Day 2024. What you need to know as the summer travel season kicks off, Orlando or International Airport is preparing for a significant surge in passenger traffic this Memorial Day weekend. If you're uh, looking here, they're saying an estimated on Thursday of 76,000 passengers. Friday, 84,000 departures, 85,000 arrivals. Uh uh, 83,000 arrivals, uh, 82,000 oh, arrivals, 88,000 wow. arrivals, you know, these massive numbers that we're talking mm -hmm. about here. And this is the kind of thing that the next data that we're going to put up, this is a lot of people. So we're, we're talking about almost a million travelers extra coming in, not extra, but, but, but coming into the Orlando area. Why is the gas so expensive in Florida? Well, because there's a tax on it. Why is the sales tax what it is in Florida? Well, because they can, if you show up and you buy things in Florida, they want to get a little bit of your money. That's why uh, the income tax is so low there. Uh, I was provided by someone, a YouTuber you all know, who's not on this panel, but uh, we admire him and we love him when he comes on the show. Something that, that shocked me. Uh, considering those figures here, these are the oh, wait time that were listed that in the MDE oh, app. Man. Uh, this is, what is that? That's uh, a five-minute wait in Adventureland right there. Oh, but boy. Anybody want to call out some rides? Is that a 10-minute wait for the Walt Disney World Railroad? Uh, that's the railroad. Is that Let's five, see. If that's, is that five minutes for Pirates? Pirates? Yeah, no, just, again, for, again for the audience, and Jonas, when, when are these wait times? These are in the middle of the day on Memorial wow. on Monday. 15 yeah. for Big Thunder. What should be That's one insane. of the biggest days of the year for the Walt Disney World Resort. We're, we're Absolutely. seeing almost nothing. Uh, Absolutely. And for those of you who want to see the other side of the park here, and I have this broken down by Ryan. 25 yeah, 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 for yeah, space. Yeah. This is this is 520 you, in the afternoon. Wait, 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 wait a minute. 25 minutes for Space Mountain. That's the walking yeah. time from the queue to the train, yes, right? It is. Vash, Vash yeah. Flight. yeah. Is that right? Yes. <laughs> yeah. By, by the way, everybody look at Bash right now. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, well, I, I, he wants I, to see every it's cropped, and I, I really want to check out these times. Sorry, guys. I, 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 I just I don't show on my together. screen, and we'll be fine. It's the it's it's the best moment ever. Uh, this this to me, okay. Obviously, uh, Space Mountain. Uh, what is this right here? Is that that's that's we, uh, story time with Belt? Fifty five minutes, I believe right here for seven it, dwarfs we, i think yeah we have no times eclipsing one hour yeah, yeah. so if if we want to look right here seven dwarfs mine train 55 wow. minutes right here i asked this person because because i wanted to be a good unbiased reporter right here meet tiana and uh and a visiting princess at princess fairy tale hall 45 minute wait that's one of the biggest wait times in the park and i said oh well that that's a good sign for tiana's bayou adventure he said no man that's a character dump, and it's always a long line, regardless of who's in there. Yeah, always. Uh, I th this is abysmal wait times. Uh, sorry, abysmal attendance. Great wait times. This is a Memorial Day would have been a great well, time to but, go into the park. But let me ask Lorena because this is this is the key question because you were there not that long ago, right? Magic Kingdom. You were there yeah, during yesterday. Yeah, that's what I thought. So 
you were there. And if you look at Seven Dwarves Mind Train at 55 minutes or whatever it said there. 55, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's um, amazing. How long do you think the line actually was? Probably about 40. Yeah. <laughs> yep. So, so Lorena, you've been there. You, you saw yesterday, which, by the way, when you, when you reserved for Memorial Day, you probably thought, oh, my gosh. <laughs> this is going to be, I mean, even when Disney is uncrowded, it's Memorial Day. It's like the 4th of July, right? Um, right. And, and by the way, folks, if you think that we're, maybe we're being too harsh. Maybe we're cherry picking times. Take a look at this, Lorena. This is from right now. If you're at Hollywood Studios, you're having a really bad time. Because not only is Slinky Dog Dash down, not only is Rock and Roller Coaster Toy Story unavailable, Toy Story Mania is down, and the wait times still are as low as they are. Uh, there's nothing to do in Hollywood Studios. So, folks, we're here to tell you, we're, we're not being mean. We're not cherry picking. Lorena, please share with us what the crowds have been like lately. Um, how different was it yesterday from what you would typically anticipate on a normal Disney World holiday? It was like a ghost town. Um, in my history of visiting Walt Disney World, um, I was so, especially when I was in college and would go, Memorial Day was crazy. Not as crazy as 4th of July, but pretty crazy. You could, you know, lots of people on Main Street. It's a sea of people you're trying to get through there. Yesterday, literally, it looked like a ghost town. And that's what hit me when I got there. I usually get on Main Street and expect to see all these people. Hardly anyone. And I was standing next to someone else who was a, you know, who was a local who spent time there as well. And, and they said the same thing. I mentioned on stream, I said, where are the people? This does not look right at all. And the people next to me were like, yeah, we've never seen it this dead, except for around COVID, like when that first happened. Literally, you hardly anybody on Main Street. And I thought, I'm like, okay, maybe it's just a Main Street thing. No, walking around the park and you can see the wait times. Space Mountain, basically a walk on. Um, Haunted Mansion. I think Haunted Mansion was 20 minutes. We got in there in 10. Uh, oh my God, of course it's a small world as a walk on, but Peter Pan's flight. Okay, we all know who nuts Peter Pan's flight is. 55 Always. minutes. That's how much it usually is first thing in the morning. And it stayed at like 55 for the whole entire day. And then Thunder Mountain Railroad, 15 minute wait on Thunder Mountain Railroad. I thought I was seeing things because I've never seen Thunder Mountain Railroad at 15 minutes, unless it's like, what, five minutes before closing time at the park, but never so the crowd levels are crazily diminished. Uh, we don't know what we're talking about here. We make stuff up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Folks, from a month ago, Disney World attendance down dramatically in two years. Wait times show May could be empty. Wow. One month ago, we make things up. We, we just, we just stop, make it up stop. as we go. Yeah, stop we making just, it up. Know, stop making don't it make up. Don't your eyes, you know. That's right. Absolutely. Lorena, the, the other side of this, of course, is we were just looking at the horrible situation for anybody who is at Hollywood Studios right now, where essentially, you know, there's nothing to do. So let's let's walk through this real quick, because you, you go to these other parks, the non-Magic Kingdom parks. Disney mm -hmm. has invested billions of dollars into these, and they have maybe worse capacity now than before. So let's just walk through this. I want people to see how little there is to do for the money they're paying. Alien Swirling Saucers, which is a glorified and not as good teacup ride. You're going to wait an hour. Um, I'm sorry. We're not, I don't care about meeting Disney stars at the Red Carpet Dreams. Sorry, don't care about meeting Olaf. The Runaway Railway, you're waiting an hour. The Smuggler's Run, you're waiting an hour. That's a video game if, that you... Exclusive yeah, ahead, of if, you, if you're a single writer, you will probably get in a Smuggler's Run in 15 minutes. Right, right. Yep. Muppet Vision, that's a, that's a theater. Rock and Roller Coaster is down. Slinky Dog is down. Star Tours, 15 minutes. So that's good. You can go ride yeah. Star Tours. Seems like the new Ahsoka stuff they've put in is really driving audiences to go see this. Look at that. 15-minute waits. Uh, people just cannot get enough of the new Ahsoka stuff that's in those. Wow. People love it. Uh, meet Chewbacca. 
Sorry, that's not a ride. No. Star Wars Ride of the R Rise of the Resistance over an hour, and the Twilight Zone Tower of Terror at 45. That's all there is to do today because Toy Story Mania is also down. That's all there is to do. Um, there you go. Have fun at that theme park with about five or six things to do and everybody having to wait to do them. Uh, I guess you're going to watch Indiana Jones and the Stunt Show Spectacular like 17 times in a row. You know, the Frozen Show, you can go in and see that or take a nap because it's cold in that theater. <laughs> 